show us some of their fan favorites. Welcome, guys. Good day, Hello. good day. How are you? So big winners on Food Network. That's right. They call the us the champions of the world. Yeah. And then you, how, did, <laughs> how did you go from having a food truck to having a full-blown restaurant? The transition was pretty natural. I mean, we both grew up in restaurants. I've been cooking for like 15 years now. And uh, I mean, that was the whole idea behind the food truck anyways, was a, you know, literally a vehicle to obtain a restaurant. And now that we have one, it's a beautiful, beautiful thing. And you're in Alhambra. I know that most yes, people throw a burger on the grill. They put on some ketchup, maybe some onion and tomato. But you guys have taken burgers to a whole new level. Yeah. If yeah. you want to replicate this at home, what kind of ingredients are we looking at? What's this? Well, this is uh, the burger called the Immortal. It's uh, It's got a nice field greens dressed with a house-made red wine vinaigrette. It's got red onion confit, uh, sautéed mushrooms, and uh, a nice uh, slice of blue cheese right on there. It sounds like something I could do at home. Maybe not the confit. <laughs> and the... Side dish here. This is our uh, anvil fries. It's a tribute to the Canadian metal bands Anvil. are actually playing tonight with Motorhead, uh, and it's a it's a poutine. <laughs> like they need a plug. It's a poutine uh, that has a mozzarella cheese curds, duck confit, uh, a duck gravy, and then just for a little crunch on top, some duck skin crackers on there. And you mentioned heavy metal. Not all of the things on your menu are heavy metal themed. That's Tell right. me about that D Snyder burger. That uh, one really D. got Snyder my is pretty amazing. That's a uh, peanut butter, strawberry jam, sriracha, and bacon. On a burger. Mm -hmm. On a half pound burger, that's yeah, right. Good. I yeah, like devilishly so. Totally brings you back to the days of Twisted Sister playing the LA Forum or something. I don't know. I wasn't alive. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I might try this one at home because I'm a big grilled cheese fan. But this is crazy. This is the Fine. behemoth, yeah. That's our biggest selling burger, actually. It's, uh, we're really known for this burger. Um, it's grilled cheese for buns, obviously. Uh, barbecue sauce that we make in house, our grilled onions, bacon. Looks beautiful there, sitting for three hours. Uh, <laughs> but uh, you know, it's yeah, it's a great, it's a, one of our biggest sellers. It's it's it, no, in fact, it is our biggest seller. Biggest yeah. seller, yeah. And, and it's also big. It's also big. <laughs> and waffles for buns. What's yeah, this here is our jump in the fryer burger. It's got uh, waffles for buns, as you pointed out. A uh, nice piece of fried chicken there. We got some uh, bacon, cheddar cheese, and then to round it all up, we got some maple uh, maple syrup and sriracha hot sauce for a little bit of sweet, savory, and a little bit of spice to it too. Yeah. New burger sriracha. every month. New burger every month, and exactly. All locale. All <laughs> locale, super healthy for you. Um, hey now. Hey now. Hey now. <laughs> Thanks so much for Thank being you very here. much. Thank you. All right, tomorrow at two. Fitness trainer Maddie Whitmore. A fun